Are you building a small form factor gaming PC? You'll need the best Mini ITX motherboard to go with it. Mini ITX motherboards are a niche product, so one has to consider certain factors before buying a board of this form factor. Similarly, we made sure we selected motherboards that fulfilled certain criteria. We've done an extensive review of the top five Mini ITX motherboards and rated them according to VRM design, aesthetics, connectivity, and value for money. Price information and all motherboards mentioned in the video are available in the description. You can also find a more detailed analysis and reviews of the best motherboards on our website, bestmotherboardzone.com. Before we dive in, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss a video from us. Number 5. Gigabyte B550i Aorus Pro Wi-Fi If you're rocking a 3000 series or 5000 series Ryzen CPU, then you might want to consider the Gigabyte B550i Aorus Pro Wi-Fi. This might be the best B550 Mini ITX motherboard on the market and should be ideal for a compact gaming PC build. The B550 platform also provides support for the PCIe Gen 4 protocol through one of the M2 slots. The B550i Aorus Pro Wi-Fi is quite a premium motherboard and it has a premium VRM setup to back it up. Since B550 allows CPU overclocking, the robust VRM can come in quite handy if you want to overclock your Ryzen 7 5800X or even Ryzen 9 3900X CPU. We would, however, advise against pairing Ryzen 9 parts with this motherboard as the VRM cooling is not excellent under extended loads. Gigabyte has provided two M2 slots under a massive M2 heat spreader in this board, which is a welcome touch. Only one of these M2 slots can provide PCIe Gen 4 functionality, however, but that is a limitation of the chipset itself. When it comes to looks, the B550i Aorus Pro is fairly mediocre in our subjective opinion. The VRM heat sinks are large and plain, which does not really fit in with the aggressive Aorus design language. All things considered, the Gigabyte B550i Aorus Pro is a solid mini ITX option if you want to go with the B550 platform. It is quite expensive, however, and there are some X570 options on the market that are better equipped in a similar price category. As with any tech product, you should do your due diligence before pulling the trigger on this one. Number 4. MSI MPG B560i Gaming Edge Wi-Fi The MSI MPG B560i Gaming Edge Wi-Fi should be on your priority list if you plan to build a small form factor gaming PC with 11th gen Intel processors. The B560 chipset is a mid-range chipset that does not support overclocking, so its offerings are budget-oriented as compared to the flagship Z590 chipset. Since it is a budget-oriented motherboard that doesn't support CPU overclocking, the VRM design is less important. However, it still should be able to handle power-hungry CPUs such as the Core i9-11900K. Thanks to a satisfactory 6 plus 2 plus 1 phase VRM setup, it should be capable of handling the 11900K at stock settings. However, due to the differences in their price brackets, it doesn't make a lot of sense to pair an overclocking flagship CPU with a budget motherboard with a locked multiplier. The Core i7-11700 or the Core i5-11700 11600 or 11400 should be more appropriate pairings. The feature set of the B560i Gaming Edge Wi-Fi is actually quite impressive relative to its price tag. You get the option of 2.5 gigabit Ether LAN and Wi-Fi 6E, which are both welcome features in terms of connectivity. For storage, there are two M2 slots and four SATA ports, another great addition by MSI to this mid-range motherboard. For more budget motherboards, you can also take a look at the best budget X570 motherboards in a recent video we did if you're on an AMD system. There are some complaints, however. The audio codec in the board is quite mediocre, and the number of USB ports on the back might not be enough for some users. In terms of aesthetics, RGB lighting is missing from the board, which might be a bit of a letdown for some users. However, this board should be read at home in a workstation PC or a stealthy black gaming PC build. Overall, the MSI MPG B560i Gaming Edge Wi-Fi might just be the best B560 Mini ITX motherboard on the market. It's also quite affordable, so you should definitely consider it if you want to build a compact gaming PC featuring Intel 11th Gen processors. Number 3. Gigabyte Z390i Aorus Pro Wi-Fi If you're on the Z390 platform with the iconic Core i9-9900K CPU and want to build a compact gaming PC, then you should consider the Gigabyte Z390i Aorus Pro Wi-Fi. This motherboard is from the fan-favorite Aorus lineup from Gigabyte and pairs a high-end VRM design with excellent features to make a really attractive package. Speaking of the VRM design, Gigabyte has done a commendable job with the power delivery of this board. Mini ITX motherboards are usually not as reliable as ATX motherboards within the same price category if we consider the VRM setups. However, the VRM heat sinks are small, and the upper row VRMs are completely exposed, so you might want to keep the VRM temperatures in check. The feature set offered by the Z390i Aorus Pro Wi-Fi is quite decent, although it does have some shortcomings. Connectivity is handled by a single 1 gigabit Ether LAN port paired with 802.11 AC 
Wi-Fi, which is not a mediocre combination nowadays. A 2.5 gigabit other LAN port would have been nice to see. When it comes to looks, it is a bit of a mixed bag with the Z390i Aorus Pro Wi-Fi. The Angular Aorus design language is evident and looks quite good, but the PCB looks a bit cluttered, especially due to the lack of a top VRM heatsink. Furthermore, RGB lighting is missing from the board, which may be a big factor for some buyers. The side-mounted RGB strip disperses light at an odd angle and doesn't really contribute to lighting in a PC. Conclusively, the Gigabyte Z390i Aorus Pro Wi-Fi is one of the finest mini ATX motherboards on the market, and probably the best Z390 mini ITX motherboard out there. The mix of reliable power delivery and a versatile feature set coupled with a reasonable price point make it a default recommendation for this chipset. Number 2. ASRock X570 Phantom Gaming ITX if you're on the AMD AM4 platform and want to build a mini ITX gaming PC, then the AS Rock X570 Phantom Gaming ITX motherboard is the ideal pick for you. The X570 Phantom Gaming VRM design is quite extraordinary. This board should be able to handle a Ryzen 7 5800X CPU at moderate overclocks with ease. AS Rock has provided a pretty decent feature set with the X570 Phantom Gaming, although there are some negatives here as well. The connectivity is handled by a single 1 gigabit Ether LAN port paired with 802.11 AC Wi-Fi. This setup might be fine in a budget motherboard, but not in an X570 motherboard in the upper mid-range. The X570 Phantom Gaming ITX looks quite decent as well, as it has some aggressive styling with red accents. This is in tune with the Phantom Gaming lineup of AS Rock products. The chipset heatsink is mounted a little more centrally, and it also fuses with the I.O. cover to give a clean look to the board. The RGB lights are mounted on the bottom of the board and look quite decent. All in all, the X570 Phantom Gaming ITX should be your choice if you want to build a premium AMD gaming PC in a compact chassis. It does lack some features here and there, but the overall package certainly makes this board the best X570 Mini ITX motherboard on our list. Number 1. Asus ROG Strix Z690i For our top pick, we have a board with the latest flagship Intel chipset, Z690, which supports the brand new Alder Lake 12th generation Intel CPUs. Z690 brings some generational improvements over the previous Z590 platform, as DDR5 memory is now supported across the board with the new 12th gen processors. We've selected the Asus ROG Strix Z690i as the best Z690 Mini ITX motherboard currently available. The strongest point of the Asus ROG Strix Z690i is its robust power delivery system, which competes with full-sized ATX Z690 motherboards. The 10 plus 1 phase VRM has 105 amp power stages, making it a great choice for overclocking as well. The VRM cooling solution is adequate as well since Asus has installed large fan heatsinks for this purpose. The flagship core i9-12900K can be paired with the Z690i as well, and you can expect moderate overclocking results on the CPU with this VRM setup. The ideal pairing seems to be the Core i7-12700K or the Core i5-12600K at fully overclocked settings. The board also has unique features such as the BIOS flashback option, clear CMOS button, two additional PCBs for extensions, and RGB ARGB headers. When it comes to aesthetics, the Asus ROG Strix Z690i is quite an attractive board. The classic Asus ROG design language is easily identifiable, and there is a healthy sprinkling of brave decisions as well. Asus has extended the I.O. cover downwards and laterally to fuse with the M2 heatsink to make one giant L-shaped heatsink cover that gives this board a unique look. The corner of said heatsink contains the ROG Strix script and the iconic ROG I. Overall, an excellent design for gaming PCs. Conclusively, the Asus ROG Strix Z690i is one of the best mini ITX motherboards on the market when it comes to the latest Intel chipset. However, it is also a very expensive motherboard since it caters to a limited market. You should definitely consider this board, however, if you plan to build a compact, high-end Intel gaming PC. You can learn more about all the motherboards mentioned at the affiliate links below. So what do you think? Do you think another mini ITX motherboard is better for your PC build? Tell us your opinion, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Have an awesome day!